Let's find the oxidation number for the sulfur, each sulfur atom, in S2O4 2 minus. The first thing we want to note, this is an ion. We have this 2 minus charge. That applies to the whole ion here. So we see that 2 minus. We know we have an ion. And when we have an ion, all the oxidation numbers, they're going to add up to the charge on the ion. So all of the oxidation numbers on the sulfurs and oxygens, that'll equal minus 2. We don't know the oxidation number on sulfur. We want to look at what that's bonded to to figure that out on each of these sulfur atoms. But oxygen, that's going to be negative 2 in almost all instances, unless it's in a peroxide or bonded to fluorine. But here, it's bonded to sulfur. So oxygen is going to be negative 2. And let's call the sulfur x. Now we can just set up an equation. 2x minus 2 times the 4, since we have 4 oxygens, that equals negative 2. So 2x minus 8 equals negative 2. 2x, we'll add 8 to each side, equals 6. Divide each side by 2, x equals a positive 3. So the oxidation state on each sulfur in S2O4, 2 minus, that's going to be positive 3. That'll be each sulfur atom has a positive 3. So that's how you find the oxidation number for the sulfur here in S2O4, 2 minus. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.